How to add Google Analytics code to your site in Builder All. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you and walk you through step by step on how you can create a Google Analytics account, how to add your website in Google Analytics, and how to add your Google Analytics code to your site in Builder All. To use Google Analytics, you need to have a Google account or a Gmail account. So if you don't have a Google account yet or a Gmail account, you need to sign up by just going to the accounts.google.com slash sign up and you will be redirected to the sign up page where you just need to input your name your username, your password, your birthday, your gender, your phone, and your uh, your uh, email, uh, your retrieval email, and then just click the blue button and sign up. As you can see, I already added my site DanaRavina.com in Google Analytics, but for the purpose of this tutorial video, I will recreate or add this site again to the Google Analytics. So first, you go to this um, left side dashboard, click this little arrow and go to the admin account, go to the admin button, and then here, just click this one and then create new account. Here, you will be directed to the new account page you just need to fill up this settings for your account um, I'll just put in Marina .com. .com. and the industry since I am in digital marketing or in internet marketing so we can use the internet and telecom unknown um, since i set my site as blogging so i'm gonna choose other the option the other options then just click this button get tracking id and then just read the google analytics terms of service agreements um, please make sure you have read and understand the terms before you accept it since i already read that and that i'm aware of the policy so i'm going to accept the terms and conditions and then here you will be redirected to the tracking code page where this tracking ID and codes are what you need to add in your site builder to start tracking your site visitors and other data for your site. So let's go to the Builder All dashboard and then go to your responsive site or blog or if your site is created in mice in this using drag and drop site builder just go in there since i created my site using the responsive site i'll um go to the settings and then i will add the codes you see i will add codes in my site in rvd.com then in order in to add that one um just click the edit button then you will be directed to your site and as you can see, I am directed to the site dashboard of my site, DanaRavina.com. So, this is where I can, uh, this is where I will add the analytics. The This is where you will need to add the Google Analytics code. So, just copy this tracking ID and just paste it there and click the save button. So, 
that's it and it will start tracking your sites data so I like Google Analytics because it tracks data of my site and its performance and uh, my site is just recently added to Google Analytics so as you can see there is no much data yet in there but I'll briefly explain to you um, how you can use Google Analytics google analytics to your advantage you can use google analytics to track how many users have visited your site and because google analytics allows you to track information about your site including um the number of people that have visited your site um your you can check it real time um, the ge geographical locations from where you say traffic is coming from and the, the length of time that your visitor stays on each page so if you explore more of on the on each options you will see um, data on the side um, so ju that's just a quick overview of the Google Analytics. I will be more detailed on how you can use and leverage Google Analytics in my next videos. So for now, um, I just show you how you can quickly add analytics to your site and guys don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i welcome any um, violent reactions comments or compliments i would appreciate that and don't forget to follow me on my social media thank you guys